Hey guys, so I just wanted to give you all an update. The last round of chemo was really, really hard. Um, I experienced this thing called neurotoxicity, which I started to have like hallucinations. I got extreme anxiety. Um, I was having really weird thoughts about like, I don't know, just strange things that I don't really want to get into. But um, it was really bad. It was like a panic attack for the four days following the five days I did chemo. Um, so like once I got home, I, I, I didn't want to leave my room. You know, I went on a drive and the drive made me so anxious. I just started to like cry because I had to go get a shot. So we had to take a drive to get the shot. But it was, uh, it was really weird and my voice changed and I was like wide eyed and it was very scary. Um, stomach wise like it wasn't that bad you know I didn't really want to eat much but, but that's pretty normal but the neurotoxicity I guess that's like a thing that happens but it's not super common but it, it happens um it's where like the one of the, the chemos goes to your brain um and it messes you up and uh, I was I was very afraid and uh it sucked and I know some of you guys texted me during that time and I just hold on I wasn't doing shit I was lying under covers in a dark room. <laughs> um, but then the week following that was one of the best weeks I've had, in, I don't know, years. I, I felt so happy. Even today, you know, like so happy. Uh, I don't know. I, I've been writing a ton of music, playing it. I feel like I'm singing stronger than ever. I feel like I'm writing great songs and just having fun and... Tomorrow I'm going to a buddy's house to record some music and um, my mom and I stopped in Monterey, which is where I wrote Sad Boy last night and that was really fun and so beautiful there. If anyone has like $3 million, they want to give me to buy a house in Pacific Grove or Monterey, California, well, let me know. Um, but... Uh, yeah, I've been really good otherwise. After that, that first few, four days following the five days of chemo, you know, it was great. I've been great. Um, I've been really happy taking every day, day by day, appreciating every moment, you know, whether it's a hike or a drive through the woods or a Chris, Chris, Chris Christopherson song or uh, playing with my dog, you know. I don't know. It's all that that matters, you know. We saw a bunch of butterflies in Monterey. Um, I guess this time of year they are up north in that area, and then they go down to Mexico. So there's like a migration. And I've actually been to the to to the place where they are in Mexico. It's in the state of Michoacan. That's where they. Um, that's where they summer or winter. I don't know. They're up there. I guess they summer down there. So, and then they do November through February in Pacific Grove and Monterey. And we saw a bunch of monarch butterflies, and that was beautiful. And uh, yeah, you know, I don't know. Played a little disc golf, but that kind of hurt where my port is. So I don't think I'll be doing that again anytime soon. And uh, yeah, like I said, I've just been writing a lot. I've been playing guitar and having fun singing and playing piano and playing with my dog and say hi Buzz yeah but yeah we're good we're getting along and uh and it's every day every day is uh every day is a war <laughs> but um a lot of days are really beautiful and uh, you just, I guess it all just depends on your perspective. And I wish I kind of knew that. <laughs> or I think I've always known that, but I guess I wish I, I, I saw it that way longer. And that it didn't take this to trigger that. Yeah, I've been really happy the last week or so. I was really happy like the week before chemo too, you know. I was playing a lot of music and 
and I'll do it again, you know? I'm, I, I have chemo on Monday, and uh, just one day, and then I will do it again, and enjoy each day once I'm out of the funk of the chemo. Um, probably go see my dad, and then back up to uh, the woods, where I've been spending most of my days. And uh, I'm loving it. <laughs> Life is really great when you just uh, appreciate it, I guess. Um, yeah, and California right now is beautiful. I have been a big California hater because most of the time it is very dry and dead looking, yellow grass, but right now the whole state is beautiful green and I've driven up and down this coast a few times now since the rains and it is beautiful and green. And uh, it's magical, honestly, you know? Well, I hope you guys are good, and we'll stay in touch. Maybe I'll post some videos of me playing guitar or singing or piano or something like that. I don't know. Love you guys. Bye. Say bye.